She picked up a syringe and calmly stuck it into the fat man's body, which was the poison he had prepared for her. The fat man struggled for a moment and fell headfirst into the water without breathing. She found the warehouse where her son was imprisoned. Looking at her son's drawings and thinking of his helplessness here, she finally couldn't stand it anymore and rushed into the sheriff's house. Her skinny body exploded with power, and she fought with the strong sheriff. The sheriff threw her out and grabbed a pistol to kill her. She plunged the glass into the back of her opponent's foot. The pistol fell to the ground. She picked it up and aimed it at the sheriff. Was she heard Jack yelling? She didn't want her kids to see that, so she took Jack and left. The sheriff came after her with his shotgun and aimed at them. Perhaps the god couldn't stand it. The shotgun blew up and the sheriff's face was a bloody mess. He pounced on them like a rabid dog. When he was about to do it again, the woman took out her handcuffs and handcuffed him to the stake. The sheriff finally panicked. The tide was about to rise, and he began to apologize and beg for mercy. But it was too late. The villain was drowned by the sea.